now, your NORCAST weather update. Brought to you by Square Theatres, South Jersey's premier movie watching experience. Visit our three locations and enjoy the big screen in comfort and style. Tilton Square, Harbor Square and Ventnor Square, a better way to watch a movie. Good early Saturday morning, meteorologist Bobby Clark here with an update on your forecast. Temperatures across the northeastern part of the country, not a chillier side, but a little bit warmer as you head towards the shoreline, obviously with water temperatures mainly in the mid to upper 50s, so definitely seeing a different change as you head towards the shoreline, but interior portions of the northeast seeing temperatures mainly in the 30s and 40s. But if we look off to the west here, this warmer temperatures, this warmer air, it's going to make its way into here as we head into, I think, a good portion of next week, but we'll talk about that though in just a few moments. Take a look at the big picture for today. We'll see ourselves under breezy conditions that east to northeasterly flow thanks to high pressure up into New England. It's going to push the cloud cover in as we head throughout the rest of today. Peaks of sunshine, but again, with that east to northeasterly flow, we'll stay about five to maybe even 10 degrees below normal for this time of year with sunshine peaking through the clouds every once in a while throughout the day itself. Take a look for the muggy meter for the next couple of days. So not looking too bad as we head into Sunday, but look at this as we head into Monday and Tuesday. We'll see temperatures pushing 70 degrees, and could we dare call it maybe a little bit muggy out there for the beginning of November? Yeah, 60 degrees starts to make it feel a little bit more uncomfortable, especially when you have temperatures only around 70 degrees or the upper 60s. So definitely something to, look, to uh, watch out for as you head out and about across the area. Take a look at the satellite picture as we head into early tomorrow morning. See nothing really going on for tonight or for the rest of today on into to later on today. But cloud cover will continue to build as we head into Sunday. Again, thanks to a low pressure system that's off to our southeast, just west of Bermuda, that will continue to spawn its way up to the north and east. Spread some cloud cover in as we head into most of the day on Monday and see ourselves maybe a shot of a shower, but not looking at any kind of like washout situation. We do have to watch the track of this upper level low uh, that the tropical or the National Hurricane Center was watching for a bit to take on subtropical uh, characteristics, but it looks like that's not going to happen, but it's still gonna be out there. So how close it gets to our shoreline will determine if we get any shower activity or not, and how, uh, how much more numerous those showers will be. But as of right now, not looking at any kind of washout as we head into Monday. As for tomorrow, we look at 64 degrees out there for an east northeasterly breeze around six miles per hour. Temperatures getting up into the lower to mid 60s as we head into most of tomorrow with cloud cover developing and pushing in as we head into later on in the day. As for your seven day forecast, again, maybe that chance of a shower or two out there, but nothing too crazy out there. We stay mostly cloudy, but look at these temperatures, not looking bad for this time of year, really where it should be for this time of year, pushing again around 70 for Monday and Tuesday with a dew point getting up into the 60s and temperatures staying with us in the mid to upper 60s. Thanks for joining me. I'll see you later this morning.